But what I can say is that I think they figured out the balance. They figured out how they can make sports betting work and, and be viable and not intermingle it too much with sports in the city. Um, one thing I will say, we've seen obviously a history with the Raiders. Um, there is a lot of temptation here in the city and it's hard to to keep your morale, I think, as a team and as a young man or woman going into, you know, a professional, you know, league and you have all this money that you just, you know, got and you don't know what to do with. And so I think it there is a little bit of a danger there in the sense that it's kind of a fun city and it's easy to get lost in this city. But at the same time, I think that sports teams have done a really good job of man of managing that in a sense and being able to to keep things you know good and, and pg and make sure that their players are on the right track and doing what they need to do and they've been winning and it's been great so to see the last few championships that we've been able to be a part of seeing how the city comes together for big parades i know the city is also um built on spirit and i think once the golden knights kind of revive the city in the essence of, of making it more of a sports team as opposed to just a you know a party scene it really started to bring more attractions to the city i really think the vegas golden knights kind of started it all and the aces as well and they really have just catapulted las vegas how popular are the aces 